Eliza was born on March 10, 2001, in Hammond, Louisiana. From an early age, she had a dream of traveling into outer space. Her father says that, at the age of three, little Eliza told her, Dad, I want to be an astronaut and one of the people who will go to Mars. She had no idea that this childish commentary would become the purpose of her life. Now, at age 18, Eliza Carson is one of the most likely candidates, but there is a risk. If Eliza manages to reach the Red Planet, she will never be able to return to Earth. Eliza, from Louisiana, United States, is one of the candidates who has more options to be part of the first expedition that will travel to Mars with the purpose of creating a human colony that will inhabit the planet in about 20 years, but it has a risk. She can never return, although she does not care, for it is her dream, and she is willing to live it. At only 15 years old, she's clear about what she wants to do in 2030, dine on Mars. Carson is part of the Mars One project, and her dream is to become an astronaut and be part of the manned flight that will travel to the Red Planet. The young woman trains daily in the Marshall Center of Space Flights for several hours a day, and also organizes visits to the training camps of the NASA. In these, she experiments and practices with elements of robotics and aviation, and also studies several foreign languages. French, Spanish, and Chinese. This to be able to interact with their future colleagues. The father of Eliza supports this challenge and says that he and the girl have already spoken of the risks involved in such a trip. The Mars One project evaluates the cost of the first flight in around $6 billion. Then they will send astronauts every two years with the cost of $4 billion per trip to form a colony of 25 humans. What do you think about this? Do you think that a trip to Mars will be possible in 2030?